welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel if i've landed here for the very first time i'm sorry it started when i said stop and you know this is a very normal thing that happens in my videos <laughs> okay so today we'll be reacting to incredible off the grid houseboat koran philippines uh, i was searching for making it happen vlog where they were actually uh, doing a tour on a lake um houseboat on a lake lake tour on houseboat what am i saying but i think you got it right because i did see them stagnant and that video and that vlog i had seen and reacted to it and a lot of people did want me to react to the second part of it but i did not get the second part i sewed my best but they don't even write like anything out of there or maybe i have missed it myself either it can be possible if you find out that this is the second part of that insane uh, filipino houseboat tour um then please let me know please like you can dm me somewhere or maybe in the comment section you can put the link because nowadays the links in comment section are working which was not working before so hopefully that will just do but i did search the same tags and same thing and i got this kind of video that says incredible off the grid houseboat i'm not very sure what this is about and it's also by um a different channel it says skara and nate I don't know if I have um, reacted to anything, anything um, from their video or something from their channel. Mm, I think so. Yeah, I don't think so. I have, but this is my first time reacting to their vlog, so get it. Let's go for it. But before that, I hope you are subscribed to my channel and click the notification bell right next to it so you don't miss out any further updates. You can also follow me on my Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. All the links will be in the description box. I know you all want a shout out and you have been asking that a lot too. But for that, you have to either become my patron or join the membership on my channel in YouTube. Um, both the links are going to be down there in the description box or bio box, whatever you call it. And you just have to click the link and just see it for yourself. You not only get a shout out, but you also get a lot of different perks and unleash a lot of different benefits. You have to choose it for yourself, but for that, you have to just click down there and see what exactly works the best for you. And if you can, if you want to support me, then I'll be more than, more than, more than grateful. And yeah, hopefully you can. Thank you so much if you do it. And shout out to our latest patron. Gary Bondo and John Kevin Reeves, thank you for supporting. It means a lot. Genuinely, from the bottom of my heart. Okay, one day, hopefully, I can go to these places that I'm just watching and reacting right now. For that, we gotta work hard. So, let's play. Just saw some prizes and oh my god. Like, just a tour or something like that cost 3000 more than $3,000 and stuff like that. Wow, that's a lot. Especially when you convert in currency, it's nuts. It's nuts. <laughs> so we have to work very hard. And here goes my headphones. Earphones, sorry. I don't understand much difference between all of those things, but it's okay. Okay, incredible off the grid houseboat. Koran Philippines. Wait a minute. Thank you. I think I did see this in the video I reacted last time. Uh, top 10 Philippines dream destination. I think so. Like, we'll see. Welcome to our home for the next Hello. two days. I'm in love with this place. This is where we're sleeping tonight. And literally, two steps from Are you serious? Is the bluest, clearest water I've ever seen. Are you serious? Yeah. Imagine life before. I can't imagine right now. <laughs> it's been so long. K N N Vlog Seven O Seven Manila Philippines. We're Karen Nate, oh and for the last four years, we've been traveling the world full time. <laughs> that was India. We're back in the Philippines for the second time. Wow. Yesterday, we woke up. I would want to do that for a living. Before making our way back. I want to do that for a living. Seriously, starts. universe. You're hearing this? Make it happen. We are back at the airport to fly to the place that I was most looking forward to visiting on this return trip to the Philippines. Okay. Thank you. I thought we were going to be in like a tiny propeller plane, oh. so I'm very happy Four, with this slightly three, bigger plane. Four, two, one. 
Wait, let's get. I swear, like this is, this is um, goals, really. A person who loves traveling, but have never gotten a chance, maybe because I'm not monetarily equipped as well. And again, never got a chance, but hopefully, maybe down in three, four years, more than that, maybe, I don't know. I'm gonna work very hard, but I really wanna live this life, really. I love traveling, I love seeing different places, it intrigues me, it makes me happy, it's healing. So, make it happen, universe. Make it happen. Okay, the ad is over. Play. Oh, one day though. Alright, just a short 40 minute flight to Peru. Okay. Ooh. Why was it so easy though? Imagine moving around without a mask, without worrying about sanitizing hands again and again. Will we ever go back to this life? <laughs> oh my god. I am Kuron. Look at the clouds. I mean, they're so beautiful. Kuron Island. Okay. Dangerous out to the island, but when I was researching places to stay, I came across something really special. Wow. I mean, this is a dream. Wow. At least for me. I would love. Oh my god. What? Wow. This is ridiculously beautiful. I feel like you might tip it over stepping in it. It's like a kayak with a motor. Wow. <laughs> Ooh. And everywhere you have to go, you have to travel with the boat. Right? Maybe I, I heard that in that Making It Happen blog. But I don't know if it was the same place or not. Welcome to our home for the next two days. It's very simple. There's not much to it, but I'm in love. I know, you don't need anything here. I'm serious. And literally, wow. two steps from our bed is the bluest, clearest water I've ever seen. Oh my god. So for How can you not heal when you go to a place like this? No tours and floors that I can literally see Filipinos don't go out, right? right like to like vacation. You have so many places to vacation itself in the house. In the houseboat, but we have a tower of outlets and our own Wi Fi router. I think my favorite part though is wow. the walkie talkie that comes with our room. We can use it at any time to call the main houseboat Brilliant. and order an iced coffee or a cocktail. But the coolest part is that all of this is solar powered and this whole complex is powered by the sun. Now let me show you the bathroom. Oh. <laughs> hey, my favorite thing, bathrooms. <laughs> running water and a toilet. This is a marine toilet and so it has a few steps. First, you need to fill it up with a little water. Oh, this is educational. And to flush, you just pump it. So no wastewater goes into the ocean. All of this goes into a tank and then a boat comes every day and cleans out the tank. The more we've learned about this place, wow. the more we've loved how intentional they were when they were building it. It's as eco-friendly as it could possibly. possibly be. And so it doesn't ruin this beautiful place that you get to enjoy. Oh so we paid $400 to stay here, which is way more than we usually pay for accommodations. But if we had some friends... A few more people could fit upstairs that we could split the cost with and that would make it more reasonable. Still expensive for the Philippines, but I think totally worth the experience. Wow, if it, it was expensive for Philippines for them, it must be crazy for us. Wow. If you're earning good enough, oh, you need to experience this. Wow. The best part about this place is that it is the only place that you can stay in all of Corona Island. So everybody else goes back to the mainland, and tonight we are the only ones, <gasps> the only tourists that get to sleep on the island. This whole complex. I is can made just up imagine how much I would have got to do to like be here. Hours, 
another one that's a little complex of sweets made completely out of bamboo and then you have the white one the only one that actually looks a little it's, bit like a boat and how do they even come out with such yeah, ideas i mean that is itself so brilliant <laughs> how do we end how do we end up back at our place okay back on track. i have not even visited like india in all a lot alone. of things to go a lot of places to go a lot of things to do one, but i do believe one, we do one, have please, certain thing in kashmir just to remind her, we are on a houseboat right now. Maybe I'll react to that. Nowhere. Maybe. We have bread and hummus, Ooh. and my oh. all-time favorite Filipino dish, Filipino ceviche. It's basically fish cooked in lemon juice and vinegar with a ton of coconut milk. Okay. So good. Let's eat. Do the food and everything charge extra? Because we're already paying so much for it. Okay, so while we were at lunch, we got the backstory on how this place started. Well, you can just jump in whenever you want, you can just come back. Sailing around the world, ended up here in the Philippines, <sighs> fell in love and built this houseboat to stay on in the winter. Wow. Then he got permission from the tribe that owns this area to permanently park it here. He built three rooms on top of it, put them on Airbnb, and the place just exploded. <laughs> and the super cool part is now he employs almost a hundred people from that local tribe and pays them almost triple the normal salary. It's almost turned into a, a social project that we get to be a part of. We wow. came here expecting a cool place to stay, but I've been super <laughs> impressed by just how the entire place is run, how environmentally friendly everything is built, and then yes. the social aspect with kind of giving back to the the tribe that owns this area. It's really neat. Yeah. Whoa. Well, I've seen so many vlogs and literally all of them are so... Hello, bartender. This is Glasshouse Seaview. Um, yes, ma'am. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Could we get two Aperol spritzes? Okay. Thank you, ma'am. He's so cool to talk in the walkie talkie. It's like, she's excited. This is so fun. Wow. Oh. Hi. And Salamat. Hope. Bye. See you later. Wow. You don't really get a sunset when you're surrounded by limestone cliffs, but look at the color of these clouds. Wow. Look at everything, like, that is a fancy dinner. What is that? So, instead of having dinner on the main houseboat, we decided to have it delivered to our private Perfect. Oh my Italian god, look at it. There are a lot of Italian options on the menu. Oh. And we went with the squid ink pasta. I'm not going to lie, I was a little nervous. Squid ink squid pasta. <laughs> it's really good. How are my teeth? <laughs> <laughs> Pretty bad. I don't think our teeth are ever going to be the same. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I mean. I've had recently, I had this chocolate oh, ice cream. Thank you. <laughs> so which made my teeth go uh, dark chocolate, like really black chocolate, no dark chocolate. Wow. This is a lifetime experience. Seriously. Oh my god. I am definitely one of the more magical places I've ever woken up. Although it was really loud last night. Why? There was a windstorm. Ah, okay. The ground but you were in between. In of... So I slept. Okay, but worth it to wake up here. You're definitely lucky if you ever go to a place like this and experience that for yourself. <laughs> I swear. Has arrived. I think I, feel, I envy them, so I, I feel they're lucky. Jeffrey. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Where are they going now? Back? Because we're the only ones that are allowed to stay overnight on the island, we can beat everybody else to all of the most popular spots. So hopefully we're going to How did they get that? This, Yay. this is like the day tour that everyone does when they come to Karo. How did they get that though? What strings did they pull? <laughs> Just kidding. Hey! <laughs> oh! Wow! Look at that place. This is probably the most popular spot in all of Crone Island, and we pretty much have it to ourselves this morning. I don't think I've racked at this place for sure. Kayangan <laughs> Lake. Thank you. <laughs> We're having trouble saying it. Thank you. 
that's Jeffrey. He is our local guide from the tribe, and he's gonna be taking us around all day. Oh, okay. Let's go. Whoa. The water in this lake was unbelievably clear. It is. I can and see that. I can see literally everything. It's so clear. I feel like we were on another planet. How do they the maintain it to be so clean? percent fresh water and 30% salt water. Oh. And it felt completely different from swimming in the ocean. The decreased buoyancy we experienced underwater almost made it feel like we were suspended in space. Oh my god. Ooh. A couple hours makes a huge difference. There were probably at least 50 people in the lagoon. <laughs> More people are filing in. Yeah. Getting here early is totally worth it. It's a thing that me and my family always does when we our next stop was Bear Cave. We go uh, to travel somewhere. Equally as beautiful. We literally go to places that's not really explored, and we go really early in the morning, so the weather is good because India is really hot. Plus, there are a lot of the crowd is like really less, and that's like the best thing. This is so serene. Chelsea, Serene, I, uh, the amount of majestic words I can think of, it's all in one place. <laughs> oh, this is, this is insane. We spent the rest of the day checking out all the best spots around Corona Island. We relaxed on remote white sand beaches, pushed our lungs to the limit to get a glimpse of a giant shipwreck. Ah, I definitely didn't see of this uh, yesterday in top 10 Philippines dream destination it is dream destination dream <laughs> went swimming through a huge school of fish this is like a shot out of a movie scene okay and swam in more shades of blue water than we ever knew existed oh my god Oh, I have no words. Okay. We the day with the sunset snorkel over a vibrant coral reef, surrounded Ooh. by translucent stingless jellyfish. Okay. And even a couple sea turtles. Hey! But turtles bite, do they? Don't they? Sorry. They do. This. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, add three, two, one. Can take just adopt me, can they? Can they? Can you adopt me? <laughs> Stop. Hello. Ah, oh, okay, not that, no problem. It's gonna get over soon though. Yeah, it's done. Ah, oh, where? Hello. Okay. Playing. I couldn't find the cursor. In the next video, we go off the beach oh, okay. track in search of what we hope will be a hidden gem. Hey, where are we? Bloopers. Oh. Ooh. I didn't understand. Oh, oh. <laughs> you can't. Oh, she bumped. I nailed my hand. Oh, gosh, I have no idea. But it's a dream. <laughs> it's like a rock. Still. Are you going? Huh? Oh, cave. Ah. This is it. Still. I grabbed my sunglasses and the sunscreen because I thought we 
we're going to a beach. <laughs> wow. Oh. Wow, though. This is insane. First, I would say you are really lucky to have someone who just travels with you everywhere. It's really, really lucky for whoever gets to do this. Goals, goals, goals for real that you can just go out and do that for a living. That's the best thing. Of course, it may have taken them a long time to reach where they are right now to get something back also because they are doing the videos, the editing. Of course, every content creator, no matter what their uh, content is, they always make videos and do that because they love, of course, but they also expect something in return at, this, at, the, at the end of the day because they are putting the work in it, of course. And if they don't get anything back, it's very hard to keep continuing those things because, well, you can't. <laughs> Human beings can't, okay? If you're an angel, you're a saint, Maybe you're a different person, I don't know. Or maybe you are just monetarily equipped, like extremely monetarily equipped from the very beginning. It's a whole different thing. I come from a middle class family. For me, it's not, it's impossible for me to go to places like this and think that I can like experience this. At least right now, I don't think so. It's far, far, far from thinking like that. So I enjoy these things virtually. But hopefully I can get someone I can travel with, it doesn't really matter if it's a guy, it's a boyfriend, it's a husband, it's a best friend, it's, I don't know, brother, girlfriend, like, best friend, girlfriend. I'm okay, I'm completely fine with who have girlfriends, I just like to say this because I specify this because I always tend to like, um, what do I say, appreciate or compliment girls more. I don't know why I just do that, but I always do that. And I've seen it happen very less and that's the whole reason maybe people thought I was bi or something. Unfortunately, I'm completely straight. I have less options, <laughs> but unfortunately, I'm completely straight. But yeah, I tend to like appreciate and compliment girls like for some reason, just, just I, can, I just do that uh, subconsciously sometimes. So maybe, I don't know. But I don't know the best friend or whoever it is, I just want to live this life. I've said this in another video too, I want this universe to like, you know, you know, the secret, you know, right? The secret, the book, law of attraction. I want to live a life like this, where I do this for a living. I just heal every day when I work and I'm, I enjoy thoroughly what I'm doing. That will be the best thing ever. And for me, at least from my point of view right now at this point, they're so lucky. I'm so, so, so envious of them. Oh my god, this is insane. I love it. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, berries. Love you.